What's cracking, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. New video. So let me get everything right over here. I think I got it right. Um, you see the topic? You see the thumbnail? The hottest. Who is the hottest right now on YouTube? Without a doubt. Bar none. Cholo Juan, man. Cholo Juan did that. Tabato was just re refused service at Burger King, homie. Tabato had, he had the motherfucking microphone out the door like, hey, homie, hey, I want the, I want it off the broiler, eh, tattoo, tacos all on the face, fucking big old ER on him. Hey, homie, I want it off the broiler, eh, saying. <laughs> he just got refused service. And now he gets to refuse service. Let me tell you, when I tell you right now, when I say this, that I have not seen this type of phenomenon for the rasa in, in, in the prison, so-called prison genre. I hate that fucking term. So-called prison genre. I have not seen this phenomenon ever. This is, a, and, and I'm going to tell you why. Cholo Juan has had a channel for a while. You know, he was doing his thing and then he fell off. And he kind of, for a second, almost got caught up in dabbling with the trolling stuff. Eh? And then he stepped away from it because he went to jail. And I'm telling you right now, I would guarantee maybe he'll talk about it later. Maybe not. But he went, he went back to, he went to the county jail. He had to sit down for a few weeks, few months, whatever it was. And he saw Vatos fighting real cases, eh? He saw Vatos that were probably never going to see the streets. And I think it had opened his eyes. He was like, what the fuck am I doing, eh? And he got back out here and he pushed and it paid off. It paid off, eh? Congratulations. Congratu congratulations, Cholo Juan, on doing that. And when I tell you this is a phenomenon, let me tell you something. I, I did on this channel, on the big channel. By the way, I was taking today off. Today is Sunday. The views aren't that good right now. Everything's kind of, you know, and I say, you know what? He popped up. He keeps popping up. And I say, you know what? Let me give this man his flowers right now. I did three videos on the big channel. I did one video on the other channel, second channel, the dub channel. I did three videos, and they're basically, they're averaging 20,000 views per video. You mention his name in the title, you show his picture, and people click on it. People are interested. Take advantage of it. Not only that, let me, I wrote it down because I did not want to slip up on it. He is now a part of the Cult Media TV podcast. Hopefully I got that right, man. They are affiliated with SKM. Make sure, Cholo Juan, everybody's equal. You know the program. Everybody's equal. You're over there. You're, you're a team player. Don't start asking for all orange or all green M&M's, homeboy. Nah, I want, the, I want the pink fucking Starburst. Don't do that. <laughs> it's a team. But make sure you're always promoting your stuff with their stuff. Um, the reality is there's more money when it's not split up. Obviously, cult media TV is going to be fair. You got, a, you got a chance. You got an opportunity. Listen, this is so hot. He's so hot right now that I see other channels commenting, not only in his comments, but I just saw a thing to Mudville Media. I think that's what he called it. He, I know he's changed his name a few times already. Shout out to that channel. Uh, he, he called in, and he was the one that trolled Cholo Juan. On, that, on this call media thing, uh, they did a live the other day, and he called in and acted like he was a probation officer. And I see other channels coming in there, right? You don't really see that. So I wanted to, to go ahead and acknowledge the success, the, the, the potential. Remember, potential ain't shit. Prison is full of potential. Swear to God, there's full of people that we're going to be the greatest at something. 
Unfortunately, their potential was never reached. And so it remains potential. Choloan, do not leave it as just potential, right? But this right here, if nobody else, people don't like me for whatever your reason, fine. People don't like other channels for whatever, fine. But you always supposed, you're always supposed to pay attention to what is successful, especially if it's in your genre if it's in your area of expertise make sure you pay attention to what someone's doing right and i'm going to tell you what they're doing right what he did right he kept it positive he had people shooting at him he said i'm not going to disrespect them but this is what i got to say you see there's a lot of other platforms that try 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 to, to build a channel by tearing a man down they don't go nowhere the only time they get views is when they mention certain people's names. I'm one of them, right? You go look at their channel and you'll see. And you'll see there in their comments when they talk about certain people too many times, their own subscribers are like, get a life already, eh? Like, move on. So what Cholo Juan did was, and again, keeping it real, he dabbled a tiny bit in the trolling stuff. And luckily, he was able to get away from it. And people see the respect that he shows to other podcasters, the respect that he's shown to Northern California, to everybody in Southern California. And I think they see, okay, this, this dude has a unique story, right? He was caught up in that indictment. Again, that was a, that was a time where he could have been washed up for life. He could have been what, done with this. No, there no YouTube. Now he has this opportunity. Uh, I believe he said in one of his videos he is a union worker and he's at the bottom of the barrel, so union work is not coming for him. <laughs> he don't need that no more. This is the opportunity to take advantage of it. Um, hopefully there are people around him that are able to show him that there's a way to really, uh, really super monetize on YouTube, hopefully you have people around you um, that are aware of that and will school you on that. Um, because there is a regular monetization on YouTube and then there's another where you can boost your stuff. Um, but anyways, I just wanted to acknowledge he is right now. He's he's the you got when you got rap. I know you guys don't like it, but Lefty Gunplay is I mean, fuck, he does anything and it just blows up. I look at success, I look at it like this, as a content creator, and I'm not going to name any names because it's, it's not even about that. There's certain rappers that I can make a video and put their name and, and, and struggle to get 10,000 views. There's other rappers, and I will say Lefty's one of them. I can put his name in there and get 20,000 views, 17,000 views. That's... The measure of success. I can talk about other podcasters. I won't. And I know for the most part what the views would be like. And I know what Cholo Juan, and I think everybody knows everybody's taking advantage of it right now. That's the nature of the beast. He's going to get you views. He's going to get you your money. And I think he finally realizes that if I make a video about him, whether I get 1,000 views or 10,000 views or 30,000 views, that's, a, that's one or 10 or 30 that know his name. And if they're not subscribed, they're going to go check him out. There you guys go. Cholo Juan is the channel. Go ahead and check him out. I have no problem uh, shouting him out. You know, somebody was like, hey, talk shit about you. Why you? I, I'm not a kid. Eh? I don't have to address what any man says about me because what any man says about me doesn't make me who I am. It's just who they think I am. Remember that. Especially if you're going to be on YouTube or any type of social media. You do you. You let your actions speak for themselves. Don't worry about what other people have to say. Words mean shit. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead. Let me see. Yeah, this. I don't want to be too long. This is, like I said, it's a Sunday. Everybody's back to the grind tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to be going live. I really wasn't planning on doing anything today. I really should because, as we talked about yesterday, views are down. Advertising, as advertising money is down. Everything is down, but it's the summer. Everybody's out running around, getting a suntan, walking the dog, whatever the hell you guys do. We get it. I get it. 
come winter time, we're going to get money, though, right? So with that said, everybody, please be safe, be smart, and tell the ones you love that you love them. I'm out of here.